I just wanted to say really quickly that after my last vlog video, I got like an overwhelming amount of messages. Like it was so sweet. I got like 30 messages from people just, and people I wouldn't have expect to, like people that I maybe not too close with or people like even haven't met before that were just like, I watched your vlog video and I was cracking up laughing the whole time. You're so funny, you're so entertaining. And I was like, well guys, like, I was like, you guys are hyping me up too much. My ego is already fucking too big. I'm kidding. I just do this because I want you guys to enjoy it and I want to make people laugh. I really, all I want to do in life is make people laugh and make their day a little bit easier, like help people out. So if any of my videos ever like made you smile or made you laugh, like that is what, that's my goal. That's what I want. And just having so many people message me saying that it was so good and they want me to keep making vlogs and like videos. After I made that vlog, I was a little nervous and after hearing all those messages, my heart is just so freaking warm, guys. It's so warm and I'm so happy and it makes me really pumped and excited to make more videos. So thank you so much. <sighs> it's freaking cold, man. <laughs> Hey cuties and welcome back to my channel for another vlog video. Right now I'm on my way to my second tattoo appointment for my half sleeve. I'm gonna take you guys along with me. Oh, if you can see how freaking cold it is in this car, I'm like waiting for it to warm up. So we're gonna get going. I should probably look up where we're going first, actually. That'll probably be the best idea. Oh, it's cold. So if I look really Hello? <laughs> what the fuck was that? So if I look really exhausted right now, it's cuz I am. It's currently 9 a.m. I was up till 6 a.m. on YouTube just watching YouTube videos. You know how you get into that like vortex of watching videos and then you look at the time and you're like shit. <laughs> No. <laughs> Basically, I use, I've use. i just been getting back into watching like YouTube videos like more lately because when I was in high school, I used to watch YouTube videos like religiously. I would get home from school and like watch all my subscriptions. Uh, like everyone I was subscribed to, I'd watch all their videos until I was done. And then I would like start, <laughs> I didn't do homework, what am I saying? <laughs> so also when I was in high school, um, Vine came out. So this, it was an app called Vine. If you're not familiar with it, it was basically like you make six second videos, which is like, it's kind of crazy that you, you could be funny in like six seconds. It like blew up the app and then people started getting famous from it and stuff. And this one guy, I remember specifically, his name was Cody Ko. I never really thought to look up the Viners on YouTube after they, they stopped being on Vine. Because I got so busy with my own life, like going into, like finishing high school and going into university, I didn't really, I didn't really have time to watch as many YouTube videos and stuff, but now I'm like really getting back into it and I'm watching all these people that used to be on Vine and oh my gosh, their stuff is so freaking funny. I watched Cody Ko last night for, I swear, maybe like four hours straight just videos. His like, cringe, that's cringe series with Noel. Okay, first of all, both of them together are freaking just like, had me in stitches, I was on the floor. I just think, like the way his humor is, is like the stuff that makes me laugh, I don't know. I just can't even explain like what his humor even is. It's just so funny to me. And I was just, I was like stuck in that for a solid, solid four hours. Right now I'm driving on my way to my tattoo appointment. I was supposed to finish my half sleeve like earlier this week, like about a week ago. About a week ago. <laughs> Anyways, I was, supposed to, I was supposed to finish my tattoo like about a week ago, but my artist emailed me and said she came down with the flu and was really sick. And I was like, oh no, like don't even worry about it. We can like reschedule. Like I'm not even, I'm not in a rush to finish my tattoo or anything. And I felt really bad because I, ha I really, really like her as like a person. So I was like, honestly, like I'm not gonna be like, no, you come in when you have the flu or like something. I don't know, I don't even think I can do that. But I was like, no, honestly, take your time. Like whenever works for you, just let me know. So I think she's feeling better now. Um, her and her wife both came down with the flu. And I was like, that really sucks. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> and so, yeah, hoping she's feeling better. And, you know, my tattoo's gonna look sick at the end. I'll show you guys, like, all of it at the end. And you can see, like, what it looks like and everything. 
Um, I'll try to get some footage during the actual tattooing process. It might be hard because I'm gonna have like one arm that's like not available to me, you know? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have one arm that's being tattooed so I don't know if I'll be able to like show you guys too much. Oh my gosh, I'm being blinded, hello? Hello? Oh no. Okay, we're good, we're good. Oh my God, that was painful. I gotta like, stand. So I'll try to film as much as I can during the actual tattooing session, but I don't know if I'll be able to film too much just because like one arm is kind of gonna be like getting the tattoo and I might like try to like film it as much as I can, but if not, I'll show you guys the after result and hopefully that'll be all good and then I'll take you with me on the rest of my day. So we're here right now, I'm just gonna park. Okay, so we're here and I'm gonna take you guys in with me. Cause oh no, is that a thing I'm gonna do now? Like the, whoa, boom. And then we like, oh, I zoomed in by accident. Hello, hello guys, hi, how you doing? I don't look that exhausted, do I? Do I look like I was up till 6 a.m.? It's like 9.30 right now. It's 9.25, I have to be there in five minutes, so. What am I doing? I didn't even turn off my car yet. That's, that's always a good idea. Okay, see you guys in there. Whoa. Yeah, I can focus. Does it work? Yes, my big hands can reach so everything. Add, a bit more up here. Yes. Are you going? Yep. Beautiful. Awesome. Lovely. Hey guys, so I just finished the tattoo session. It is 12.05 right now. I actually did get some footage because my tattoo artist is super cool. Um, I'll link her Instagram down below so you guys can go like check her out if you want to get a tattoo from her, or if you want to follow her, look at her stuff or anything, I'll link her down below. She was super cool and let me film during the session. I did get one clip about it, so I didn't want to like film the whole time because I was talking with her most of the time. She is super cool, like probably, honestly, one of like the coolest people I've ever met. I say that very genuinely, like she's probably one of the coolest, most down-to-earth people I've ever met. Um, and it's really cool to like connect with someone like that. We originally kind of connected over, we both played basketball growing up and into university. And so we both had very similar experiences with like teammates and coaches and just kind of, we talked about that and we're really relating to each other with that kind of experience and I thought that was really cool because I'd never met someone who'd really gone through the same experiences I did when I played university basketball and it was really in interesting to talk with her about you know coaches she's been with and you know like because my dad coached me and her dad coached her growing up and then like other coaches and like teammates and stuff and like team dynamics so it was really cool to talk about that with her and we just had so much in co like as we got talking more and more we had so much in common and she's like usually I don't talk to like when I'm tattooing and stuff 
Um, but like we just were, we vibed so much in the first se tattoo session. We talked for the whole four hours. Like literally, I told her things that like normally I just like don't tell people. But we were just like, like probably too much information with each other. But like I don't know, it just felt so comfortable. It felt like I had known her for so long. And I feel like if anyone's doing something like permanent to your body, like a tattoo, you want to trust them and like feel like you've known them for a long time. So that was a really nice thing. I don't know, she's just so cool and has such an awesome perspective on like life because she's been through so much and like so have I, but she's obviously a lot older than I am. Like she just has such an awesome perspective and has been through so much and learned so much through life that it's like, it's such a positive thing to see her and see her doing well and like, I don't know. It was just awesome and I really, really like her. <sighs> Fuck, that'd be so awesome to have her as a friend, like she's so cool. And honestly, I recommend her if you're ever getting a tattoo. She specializes in, like she says, she specializes in like furry creatures. So anything like with fur, like any sort of animal, if you ever want an animal tattoo, I totally recommend going with her. Like the way she does the tattooing, like the technique to it is so gorgeous. It looks so realistic. The fur on the animal, the eyes on the animal, it's just insane. And I'll show you guys. I, I did a little clip of it in the mirror, but I'm gonna show it again. Like I'll try to take a video when it's healed and then I'll put this video up, I think. Like that's what I'm thinking I wanna do because when it's healed, you'll see it all together and it'll look really awesome. Like, I'm so excited to be like done my tattoo now. I'm kind of addicted to getting tattoos now and I kind of think I want a full sleeve. I'm not sure yet. I have like an idea of what I want to get like up on my shoulder and stuff. One of my first YouTube videos, I did a, like piercings 101 video and I was thinking of maybe, cause I have seven tattoos now and one's a half sleeve, one's a big one on my back. And I was thinking, I have footage from my first tattoo and I was thinking of doing a video like kind of tattoos 101 and like what to expect in your first tattoo kind of thing. If you guys would want that, like this video and comment down below letting me know that you, you want a video like that, like maybe a tattoos 101, like you know, some aftercare tips, like what to expect when you get your first tattoo, what to look for, and like how to go about getting your first two, like how to research an artist and like pick one that's good for you and everything. If you guys want to know about that, like totally let me know and also if you wanted a video on what my tattoos mean or like if you wanted me to go like show you all my tattoos and tell you what they mean like totally let me know down below because I will do those videos or like DM me on Instagram or something that would be really lit hey guys so I'm back at home now honestly like like give me some feedback let me know if the videos are too long if you would like just get straight to the point kind of thing in vlogs like if there's something you're doing like don't like film all the fluff or you know what I mean or if you like kind of the fluff or you want like montages of where I am. So just let me know if that's like something that, you know, oh, I like your videos, but maybe they go on for a bit too long. Like, just let me know. Give me some feedback. That'd be great. So I'm back home and, uh, yeah. Fury, you, you're the most requested thing to videotape on my YouTube channel. How do you feel about that? Everyone just wants videos of you. I just want videos of you, baby girl. Yes. Oh yeah, you're so sweet. You're so cute. Oh yeah, just baby. What do I say? I don't know how to do that. This is my love flow. Hey. <laughs> We're on our way to the canal. We're gonna go skating. Yeah. It's, it's frozen again. It melted and then it froze again. So. You look so freaking cute. <laughs> I'm ready to fall on my ass. <laughs> I'm so, I'm literally so bad at skating. I always ask people to teach me how to skate and then I just I fail miserably. <laughs> okay, come along with us. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, she's freezing. <laughs> My abs are hurting now. Jeez. It's taking so long. Yeah. Oh, my hands are actually freezing. Red. Me too. Ah, my hands are cold. Pinky's up. <laughs> yeah, 
Look like a dweeb in this hat. I love it. You look so cute. I wanted to say thank you so much for watching all my videos. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe down below because that would help me out so much. And I love you cutie so much and I hope you have a great day. I guess I gotta fucking unbuckle for this. Mwah!